Yeah. The very first question is, do I have your permission to distribute this video? Yes. And what is your first and last name? Keegan Glick. I had Who's to think Jesus about that for a you? second. Who is Jesus to me? Man, that is a really great question because Jesus is so many things to me in regards to my Savior, my Comforter, my friend, my guide. And, you know, for lack of a better term in terms of who Jesus would be to me, he's just the answer. You know, outside of a, a father, outside of that personal, real relationship you have, the more places you go in life and the more challenges you have, the more situations you're involved in, when you look back, everything starts running back to Jesus was the answer of that situation. I should have brought this to him first. And whether it's you needing a deeper relationship with God, if you need help, or if you just for the sake of wanting to know Jesus, just come closer to him, the answer is always him. So the, Jesus is the guiding light of every aspect of my life and every interaction, every situation. He's the core, core of it all. Why should I care? You should care because to be loved fully and unconditionally is actually an extremely rare and I don't even know if it's a possible thing for normal humans. And when you finally experience the love of Jesus and the acceptance and where he, how he meets you right where you're at and is willing to take all your brokenness and work with you on it and not judge you for a thing, it is a life transforming situation that even if you fall out later down the line, you'll never completely walk away. He'll always be in the back of your mind. So the reason you should care is if you really care about yourself, if you care about your family, if you care about anything, putting Jesus first is going to make that better.